Ocean explorers, here we go. Under the waves, adventure ho. Ocean explorers, here we go. Under the waves, adventure ho. In the water, under the sun. Down in the reefs, in the ocean. When we're playing, learning with friends. Together, the fun never ends. Ocean explorers, ocean explorers, ocean explorers. Let's go! Greetings, ocean explorers. It's a beautiful day to be out on the sea. The sun is shining, the breeze is blowing, and Dean could not be happier. <laughs> you got that right. Today, we are meeting our friend Neptune. He wants to show us a special surprise. Do you want to come and explore with us? All right! Explorer friends, how are you? Come along with us and we'll learn something new. I don't see Neptune. Do you see him, Dean? Ooh, I see him. No, that's not Neptune. That's just some seaweed. <laughs> Hi, everyone. Did that seaweed just talk? Yeah, it's me. Oh, good job hiding, Neptune. Come with me. I have a special surprise I want to show you. Oh, I made a new friend, and I'd like you to meet him. He's a lobster. I've never seen a lobster before. Hey, Dean, have you seen a lobster? Huh. Are they red? Hmm. Well, some of them are, yes. Well, do they have claws? Yes, they do. Do they live underwater at the bottom of the ocean? That's right. Nope, never seen one before. <laughs> well, you can meet one now. My new lobster friend is right over here. Should we? Take a closer look. Yeah! <laughs> when you're feeling curious and you want to know, take a closer look and your mind will grow. Lobsters are usually brown, which is great camouflage. Camouflage means they blend into the brown ocean floor. So they're good at playing hide and seek, just like me. That's right, Neptune. But lobsters can come in many different colors. They can also be yellow or orange or even blue. That helps them hide in other places, too. Look, all the lobsters have one small claw and one big claw. Lobsters use their big claw to help them catch food. Lobsters also have a bunch of little legs. That's right, Neptune. Lobsters have five pairs of legs. What's a pear, Cal? Well, a pear is a set of two things that are alike. Tinker, you have a pair of eyes. Dean, you have a pair of ears. Can you help us find other pears? Great! Can you find the pair of seashells? That's right! A pair of seashells is two seashells that are the same. Can you find the pair of fish? You got it! A pair of fish is two fish. Now, point to the pair of lobsters. Great job! You found all the different pairs. <laughs> Shells, a pair of whales. They look the same. They're all a pair. Where, where, where's the pair? A set of two things. That's a pair. They look the same. Look over there. A set of two 
things that's a pair A pair of eyes, a pair of legs, a pair of hands, they're all a pair A pair of seashells, a pair of whales, they look the same, they're all a pair That was fun Look, a pair of lobsters is swimming away Lobsters can swim forwards or backwards. And if they need to move backwards quickly, they shake their tails back and forth. Today, we learned about lobsters. They are usually brown and they can swim forwards and backwards. They also have large claws. We also learned about pears and picked out pairs of claws, eyes, and ears. What about feet? Uh, what about them, Tinker? My pair of feet like to dance! Dance party! What a day, what a day! It's so much fun! Playing with friends by the ocean! Down below in the water, up on the shore! So much to learn, so much to explore! Until then, keep exploring!